Anna from Sweet Valley Herbs. Today I'm going to show you how to make a herb garden, a mint tea herb garden for mom for Mother's Day. The first thing you're going to need to do is go to your local garden center and find your Sweet Valley herb mint plants. You'll need about four, four or five mint plants as well as a strawberry plant. And this variety is a sweet alpine strawberry. It's ever bearing so it will bear fruit all summer. And you will also need good quality potting soil. Another thing that I add in my planters is worm castings, aka worm poop. I, I usually put about one cup in a pot this size and then you just you mix it in with a little bit of water. Make sure your potting soil is nice and moist and that your plants are watered before you plant them. The mint plants that I've chosen for my Mother's Day herb garden is Mojito Mint, I have Spearmint, I've also chosen a new variety that we carry after 8 Mint, got Pineapple Mint, which I really like the variegated leaves on this variety, and of course my Strawberry. So I think what I'm going to do first is put my Strawberry at the front. You don't want to fill your pot with soil either, you want to make sure that you leave a little bit of room for your plants to grow and expand and also also make sure that you have enough room that when you water your pot the water is not going to flow over top. So I'm going to put my strawberry I think in the front and my spearmint I will put over to this side and I know that mint does have a lot of runners on it but the runners do actually look cute when they hang over the pot and this is a better way to grow your mint I think than putting it in your herb garden. We all know that mint can be a little bit unruly, so if you plant it in a pot, you won't have to worry about it taking over your garden. Put the variegated one. I think I'm going to put that one in the center. And in the back end, the chocolate after eight mint. Now, once you have all of your mint and your strawberry planted, you're going to want to incorporate a recipe. You can go on our website at sweetvalleyherbs.ca and print off a recipe, or you can make up your own recipe for mom. Now we have a lovely tea herb garden for mom for Mother's Day.